Good morning. I can't find my sticky notes, but I wanted to do something quick. So on Monday, I was trying to meditate, and I was having the hardest time. I kept comparing myself to others, how other people meditate for longer times than me, how they'd always brag about different things that they would have going on, and I don't have that. And I decided to meditate on why is it so important to me to compare myself while I'm doing this. It's not the only thing that I've done this with. Why must I compare myself to someone else every time I'm doing something? Well, it turns out it's something I do to keep myself safe. It's something I do to motivate myself. Is it really motivating? Not at all. I've found with writing in general, if I do like a pep talk in the mirror before I do it, I get it done way faster, maybe four times faster, ten times faster. It doesn't take me like days on end to get it done. I get it done when I get it done, which is that day. So, something to think about. We hate to get triggered by things. This is something that I saw posted by the holistic psychologist, and it reminded me of when I was meditating on Monday. When you get triggered by something, try to explore it. See where it takes you. Try to understand, why does this bother me? There's a survival tactic that you're still using that's not useful anymore. Comparing myself to other people, it's not motivating me anymore. And it's not keeping me safe from anything. Because before, I used to do it so that my mom couldn't get mad at me and give me a hard time with my day in some form. If I were to compare myself before she could do it, then I couldn't fail her. So figure it out. If something bothers you today, ask yourself, why does this bother me so much? And why do I want to go to this area of running away from it, maybe? And where can I go from there? It's, a, it's an opportunity to grow when you get triggered. So take it. Have a great day, ladies.